So as soon as you finish your book openers, come up to stand. And we're gonna go into our workout and I will explain it to you. So today you're gonna to have a set of, I'll show you, you can see. Does that show backwards? Uh, oh, it looks backwards for me. Is it backwards on your end? Oh, it's good, okay. So I will repeat it to you so that you'll know. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. So there's seven exercises and every minute you're gonna do one of them. So basically for seven minutes, you'll have a different exercise on each minute at the beginning of the minute. Um, I'll tell you ahead of time. So uh, this is called an every minute on the minute uh, format. In the first minute, we'll do it together. You guys are gonna do, it's called one and a half squats. So what it'll look like is, I'm gonna do a full squat, come up, and then half a squat, that's one. Full squat, half a squat, that's two. So from the side, look at this, full squat, half squat, full squat. So in the first minute, you're doing 10 of those. And I will tell you before everything comes up. In the second minute, you guys are doing push-ups. I don't want knee push-ups, so if you have something that's elevated, you're gonna use that. But essentially, because I want your body to be in this position, and if you can't, if you have to do it like this, I'd rather you have a table, but you're doing that plank position. So if you need to get some kind of elevation, get that. In the third minute, we're gonna do the runner lunges that we just did in the warm up. So it'll look like this. You're doing, you're doing seven on each side. So after I get through seven, I'll do seven on the other side, and then I'll rest till the next minute. I'm just going over it real quick, and then because we're gonna all do it together. And then the next minute will be called a jumping jack to low jack. What it'll look like, but let's see if I have. So you're gonna do jumping jack, low jack, jumping jack, low jack. We're gonna do 10 of those. The next minute after that, we're gonna do a side plank twist, which will look like this. So you're gonna be in a side plank. You're gonna twist under and back up. You will do that continually time which will tell you that we'll do the other side and then the last minute you'll be doing that bear crawl position we had except for now you're moving forward you're moving back you're moving forward for a certain amount of time which I'll tell you and then we'll rest and then we'll repeat it two more times so does that make sense everyone give me a thumbs up because I will give you a heads up too Awesome. So what we're going to start off now, let me see if this will help. Actually, that's good. That's your timer. We're starting off, and it's going to be nonstop until we get through all seven. So for the first minute, I'm going to start. It's the one and a half squats. You're doing 10 of them. You ready? And start. Exercise. Okay. Good. And after you hit 10, you're just gonna rest. It doesn't feel hard right now, but just rest. As soon as you hit the 10 of the one and a half squats. So on the next minute, which has come up soon, you're doing the 10 push-ups. So I would say eight to 10, and ideally using an incline if you can't do a push-up from the floor. So here we go. Three, In three more seconds, push ups. Rest. Oh, what's happened to my timer? Oh. I apologize, my timer's a little messed up. Let me get rid of the rest. All right, that was my bad. Now we're gonna go, we're just gonna go straight into it. 
the runner lunges. So you're gonna do seven on one side and then seven on the other side. And start. Exercise one. After you hit seven on one side, give me seven on the other. And once you hit the seven, you're gonna rest until the next one. The next one is gonna be 10 of the jumping jack, low jack. That's one. Okay, so it'd be like a jumping jack and a baby jumping jack. And you're gonna do 10 of those. Here we go. Three, Three two. One, go. Exercise two. Good. And you rest. So the next one is going to be, you're going to be in side plank position, reach under and go. You'll continue that. It'll be for 35 seconds. All right. Three. Here we go. One. Okay. Exercise three. So in and out. I'll tell you when it's time, so don't even stress it. And remember to tuck your pelvis under a little bit so it's forward. Guys, have a little less than 10 seconds. You okay there, Michelle? Okay, cool. All right, you guys can rest. So the next block is the other side, and we're doing it for 35 seconds. I'm so sorry. It's, oh, you guys can have music on if you need, but as long as you can hear me. All right. Five more seconds, you're gonna do the other Three, side. Two, one. Here you go. Exercise four. Remember to keep your, your butt pushed forward a little bit. You don't want your butt sticking out behind you. You wanna push your pelvis in front of you. Guys still have about 10 more seconds. Okay, you can rest. So the last part of this block is the bear crawl. So this is where you're in this position, but you gotta maintain that low knee and you're just gonna take, let's say five steps in front, five steps in back, and just keep going forward and back. And the key is not to stop and maintain that low knee position. Three, two, All right, one. same idea, 35 seconds left. So just try your best to maintain on the balls of your feet and the palms of your hands. Let's see if our time is. Yep, you guys are doing great. Just 10 more seconds. Okay. And rest. All right. I'm giving you guys just a few seconds. We're repeating all those exercises a couple more, two more rounds. So you ready? 
make sure everyone's good to go. So what we're going back to is the one and a half squats. You're doing 10 one and a half squats. Everyone's good to go and start. Exercise one. One and a half squats. Good. And then you're resting. Next minute is back to the push-ups. So I said 10, but if some of you can do more, you can do more. If you need to do less, it's fine. This is just more about just each minute we're doing something. All right, five seconds to go, and we're gonna go to our push-ups. Two, one. There you go. Exercise two. <sighs> Good. I see you working. How you doing, Amy? <laughs> Excellent. So you guys are resting. We're going to the runner lunges, but this time you're going to do eight, eight on each side. All right, we're getting there. So remember the runner lunges is three. A hop two, when you lift your knee up. One. And six, here we go. Three. Eight on each side this time. And once you do that, we're resting. All right, what we're gonna do next, it's the jumping jacks to low jacks. This time, instead of 10, you're doing 12. So 12 jumping jacks to low jacks. All right, here we go. One, Twelve. Four. Everyone's killing it. What we're gonna do next is back to the side plank twist. This time we're going for 40 seconds, which means we'll keep going until it says 20 on the screen. All right, here we go. Three. Side plank two, twist. One. Exercise five. Keep your pelvis tucked under. Let's see how we are on time. Keep on going. Okay, you got five more seconds before we hit the other side. All right, you can rest. All right, we'll be doing the other side.
Here we go. Three, two, one. And start. Exercise six. If you have problems maintaining a good position, just holding a side plank is fine too. You guys have three more seconds. All right, you can rest. We're gonna go to the bear crawl, but this time it's going to 40 seconds also. So enjoy the rest. And then we're gonna go to the bear crawl. So remember, forward and backward a few steps. Worst case scenario, if you're really out of breath, just hold the position, but that means knees elevated. Here you go. You can do it. We're doing it together. Only a few more seconds. Less than 10 seconds. Okay, you're gonna rest. You can rest. We're gonna do one more round of all these. So you got through it all. And after this, we'll have a little baby finisher and then you can start your day. All right. Three, two. I'm going to restart it. So the one and a half squats, because it's our last round, you're going to give me 12 of those. 12 of the one and a half squats. Is everyone okay to go or do you need a couple more seconds? Good to go. Thumbs up. Okay. Ready? And one, we're doing 12. Excellent. And you guys are going to rest. This time, 12 push ups in about seven seconds. Do your best. If you need to take a pause, you can pause, but try to hit all 12. Exercise two. Killing it. What we're gonna do next is the runner lunges. This time it's gonna be 10 on each side. <sighs> 10 runner lunges, enjoy your rest. So remember, when the knee comes up is when you do a little hop. It's like hop and then down to the lunge. Hop, down into the lunge. In three. Two, one. one. Exercise three.
Excellent. What you guys will do next, we're doing the jumping jacks to low jacks, 15, but this is your last one of these. So 15, jumping jack to low jack in five seconds. Three, two, one, exercise four. Good, keep on going. And next on deck, side plank, twist, or just hold side plank. We're going for 45 seconds. It's your last time you're doing it. Three, two. Here we go. Exercise five. 45 seconds. Almost there. Rest. Then we're going to hit the other side. Three. Here you two, go. Other side. Exercise six. Almost there, less than five seconds. And rest. All right. The last of our main workout is the bear crawl for 45 seconds. Get ready. Three, two, one. Exercise. All right, 45. Looks like about less than 10 seconds. Stay with me, stay with me. Five, three, two, one. Woo! All right, you're gonna rest for a little bit. We only have one last part, which will not be for time. I will explain it. So this is what we're gonna do. You're doing four exercises, which you wanna not stop on. And you can get through all four. We'll rest together. And then we're gonna do it together two more times. So the magic number is 30 of everything. So you can do 30. I'll give you the, all y'all amount. So squat jumps, which it looks like this. If you have knee issues, change it to this. Squat, arms overhead, squat, arms overhead. 
So 30 of those. And then the next exercise is 30 skaters. Uh, let me see if I can do it without slipping. So it literally look like this. See how my leg, so you're gonna try to go, it's easier for me to do on the rug this way. So 30 of those, but if you have knee issues, let's change it to this. You're gonna be, you're doing burnout lunges. You're gonna count 20 on each side as your burnout lunge. That's the alternative to the skaters. The third exercise, you'll know very well, you're just doing regular old squats, all right? And then the fourth exercise, so the first two are jumping, the second two are not squats, and then just lunges, 30, so 15 per leg. We're gonna do that together, 30 of everything, and then rest together and hit them two more times. Make sense? Okay, all right, so there's no timer. It's just gonna be, let's do it together and keep each other going. So let's start with the 30 squat jumps. Squat jumps or squat to arm raise, okay? So it'd be like this. So let's go. Come on, Sally. And then you're gonna go straight into your skaters. Okay, skaters or do the burnout lunges. So really leap far to the side, just 15 each side. And then go straight into your 30 regular squats. So it's just this, no jumping. Ideally, butt goes below the knee chest up, but if you have any issues, it's okay if it's a partial, but try to get it low. And finish, once you finish your squats, go straight into your 30 lunges. We'll rest after. No jumping on this one. Back knee gets low, as low as possible. I'm gonna give us a short little rest. Once you guys finish together. I see you, Grace, keep going. Does anyone have knee issues? Raise your hand if you have knee issues. Okay, the jumping's no good, right? So yeah, uh, if the, like I said, for instead of the jump squats, just give me a squat with arm raise. And if squatting is an issue, then you can do 
not quite a deep squat. All right, I have one Spanish show. I just wanted to give you guys a heads up. So Thursday normally would be noon, but the uh, trainer can only do 9.30. It will be with weights. She's excellent, she's out of Philly. So every, every, day, every week, it'll be a different trainer doing slightly different workouts, so kind of fun. All right, let me give it a 30 second break so Grace can catch up and then we're gonna go together. Okay, you can hear? Oh, oh, you're not, you're muted? Uh, oh, I can't unmute you, I don't know why. All right, here we go. This time, don't wait for anybody, just go. So 30 squat jumps, 30 skaters, 30 regular squats, and 30 lunges. So on the lunging, it's always 15 per leg. And here we go. Here's something to get you going. This is gonna be your last round. We're not doing one more. We're out of time, so give it your all. All right, everyone's almost done. Come on, you can do it. Let's go, Amy. Oh, Amy, you're done, I see. So I'm high-fiving you. High five. Um, you guys can unmute yourself. If Hey, Alex, how you doing? Good. Unmute yourself, I'd love yeah. to hear any feedback. Um, that was awesome. Great. Yeah, great, thank you so much. Oh, I'm so glad you guys came. If you ever knew, I mean, is body weight actually the easiest for all of you? Yeah. Yeah. It's fine. Okay. It was great. 
Awesome. So Thursday, uh, the coach, um, I, I see she's very strength based, like her, her, uh, her gym is, but she knows that most people won't have any equipment. So I think if anything, a dumbbell, but I'll let her know that most people don't have um, weights. And uh, the following week, I'm going to have, uh, yeah, anyways, they're all women that, they're, they're all women, they're all women trainers whose styles I think are uh, diverse, but really excellent. And thank you guys for all coming. Thanks, Thanks you. Gina. Yeah. Have a good, have a good day. Thank you. you. Too. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Bye.